Okay, now we're going to look at mixture word problems. These are going to work very similar. First thing we have to do is we have to read through and we have to write down what we know. The hospital pharmacist wanted 250 milliliters of a solution that was 72% iodine. How many milliliters of a 40% solution should be mixed with how many milliliters of an 80% solution to get the desired amount? So first thing I have to do is I have to write down what I know. The hospital pharmacist wanted 250 milliliters. So that's what they want to end up with. That's how much. So they want 250 milliliters of a solution that was 72% iodine. So they want the final percentage to be 72%. Well, let's see what they're working with. How many milliliters of a 40% solution Okay, so I've got an iodine solution that is 40%. I'm just going to call it I sub 4. And I know that it has a solution of 40%. And over here, I have the iodine that is 80%. Now I need to ask myself, well, how much do I have? Well, how much of the 40% solution do I have? I have no idea. So I'm just going to call it I, and I'm going to use the subscript 4, and that's just so I can remember which one because I'm dealing with two iodines, and I want to make sure I keep clear which one's which. So if I have I amount of the 40% solution, the 80% solution, I have 250 minus the 40 percent solution. Now for my concentration I'm just going to multiply 40 times I gives me 40 I and again this subscript has no mathematical bearing it's just to help me keep it straight. Distribute 80 times 250 gives me 20,000 80 times negative I so minus 80i, 72 times 250 gives me 18,000. So if I add how much of the 40% 40 40 solution to how much of the 80% solution, I'm going to get my final solution. So now I'm just going to go through and do the math. So 40i sub 4 plus 20,000 minus 80i sub 4 is equal to 18,000. Now I'm going to go through and I'm going to combine my like terms. 40i sub 4 minus 80i is going to give me a negative 40i plus 20,000 is equal to 18,000. I'm going to subtract 20,000 from both sides using my inverse operations. So now I have negative 40i is equal to negative 2,000 going to divide both sides by negative 40 and negative 2,000 divided by negative 40 is equal to 50. Show you with the calculator. So 2,000 divided by 40 does give me 50 just like I thought. So if I have 50 milliliters of the 40 percent solution. I'm going to need 250 minus that of my 80 percent solution. So my 80 percent solution I'm going to need 200 milliliters.